Bueno, 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 bueno. Welcome, everybody. Right. Please, everybody, uh, you can uh, connect your audience. So you Stevens Point is a very nice, homey town. I've been living here since 1970 with my husband, Jan. There are people in Stevens Point that are homebodies. That's the kind of town it is. Many people stay close, but I got a travel bug because my mother always loved history. Do you remember the Bay of Fundy where we were down here? There's me yeah. poking out and the water. I became a teacher, so education means a lot to me. And I hope I instilled in my students a love of continued learning. I tried being a lifelong learner, and that's what I think a lifelong learner is, someone who learns forever. And here you were just measuring the snow that was on the edge of a porch. Look, look at what, it's still one of my favorite yeah. sweaters. <laughs> that was... Yeah, because it had a Road Scholar there. is a nonprofit that takes people all kinds of places they may never have seen before. We took our first Road Scholar trip in 2007. We absolutely loved it. We were dog sledding and snowshoeing, and after that it was all over. They don't just show you the sights, they also teach you. That's one of the things that drew me to Road Scholar because it is a nonprofit and its purpose is education and is helping other people. It's been a wonderful experience. Northeastern states, more lobster fishermen. <laughs> more lobster, mm -hmm. you want to eat more? What are you going to want for supper tonight, huh? Lobster. Sure. <laughs> My husband has kidney disease, and that makes him relatively weak. So he doesn't like to be away from home very long. He used to love to travel. He still wishes he could, but, you know, it's very difficult. Here you go. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Enjoy. The adventure visiting Antarctica with your friends of Rod Scholar. Road Scholar at Home was a lifeline for me when I first heard about it. it. Saved my life, I think. When the pandemic began, people who couldn't travel wanted those experiences. The online programs were excellent for that. After COVID was already running rampant through the country, we couldn't get the COVID vaccine for quite a while. Road Scholar at Home was a chance to learn things without going out and endangering our health. I just felt a great sense of relief. I have taken over 80 courses. Some of the online courses are three days or four days, and some are just one hour. And the experts are really superior. And the breadth of courses for me are varied enough. The Zoom technology is very, very easy to use. It's so much easier to be out and about in a way when you're online. I can still learn and he can stay at home. The modern scientific and industrial discoveries of the 19th century. I feel actually pretty good. I am 76, but I feel more like 65. I'm not too old to run races. I'm not too old to visit our daughter in Las Vegas. If I didn't have the ability to use technology, I think I would sink into depression and shrivel up. I love learning. That's what drives me to continue Road Scholar. It allows me to take classes in person and online, and I can learn and learn and learn. Mm -hmm.